Hey everybody, welcome to another Candy in the Car review. As you can see, I am at the Goodwill getting some of my last minute things for my end of the month Halloween thrift store haul, so make sure you stay tuned for that. Um, but I did want to sneak in one of these Candy in the Car reviews because I am actually trading in my little convertible here um, on Monday of next week. So this might be the last one, maybe. I might have to squeeze in a few more because who doesn't like candy? But today we are going to be trying these Linder truffles. It is another lin uh, limited edition bag. It is strawberries and cream. I'm looking forward to this because the um, like when I get the Godiva um, box of white chocolate, which is one of my favorite things to ever eat. Um, you know, I really love the ones that are the strawberry filled white chocolate truffles. So I think hopefully if these can, you know. Um, stand up to those in any sense I'm going to love these and we'll probably have, well there's no probably about it I'm sure I'm gonna end up eating this whole bag which let's see how bad that will be for us there are seven servings in this bag of three truffles each and that would run you 230 calories so let's go ahead and open this up and see how good they are the back here reads have you experienced the smooth melting lender Oh, have you experienced smooth melting Linda? Well, that's kind of a weird question. Um, I have, and I love it. And if you have had these, I'm sure you know what I mean. They have that wonderful melting quality. Um, when you put them in your mouth, they just ooze goodness. So it does call it irresistibly smooth on the cover here. White, I'm sorry, it's strawberries and cream, white chocolate truffles. It is a strawberries and cream, a delicate white chocolate shell infused with strawberry and... I cannot read today. All right. A delicate white chocolate shell infused with strawberry envelops an irresistibly smooth strawberries and cream truffle filling. Yum. Okay, so let's go ahead and open it up. Obviously, this is a Valentine's Day treat, but who's going to wait till Valentine's Day? Not me. There are lots of fun Valentine's Day chocolates in the store. I just grabbed these because they stuck out on the shelf all pink and I couldn't wait to try it. So anyway, here we go. It's truffle. Hmm. It's not exactly what I thought it would look like on the inside because it's very white on the inside. I guess it kind of shows a very pale pink in the picture. So I was expecting a pink interior which it is not at all. You can see there are a lot of little pink flecks and crunchy bits in the candy coating shell. Look, mm. It's a very mild <coughs> strawberry flavor. It's not overwhelmingly intense, which I was kind of afraid. A lot of the times when you get any of these sort of strawberry flavored chocolates, it has that very fake strawberry taste, kind of like a Nesquik sort of um, stuff that you put in that in milk. At least I did when I was a kid, and I'm sure you know what I'm talking about, but that's what I was expecting it to taste like. Oh. Hmm. It doesn't. It has a, a nice strawberry flavor, so I'm pleasantly surprised by that. And, you know, I mentioned the exterior had those little crunchy bits. I'm not sure if that's actually crunchy bits. I may have just imagined that. Let me give another one a taste test just to check. Mm. I'm trying to just eat that little bit of exterior shell. Yeah. Maybe it's just little bits of strawberry flavoring in there. I'm not really tasting yeah, that sort of crunchiness I thought I did at the beginning. So I'm a little surprised it's not a little more melted than this. It's not a very creamy inside. Now, I just purchased these from the store. I got them at um, Publix. Let me dig out the receipt here real quick. Hold on. Hmm. Now, don't usually like to buy these at the Publix because I know 
They're a bit overpriced, and you can usually get them at Walmart, like $5. And I actually paid $6.99 for this, which is a little crazy. So I wouldn't recommend getting them at the Publix, but I would definitely recommend getting them. They were fairly good. Um, you know, definitely have no problems with these, which I'm kind of trying to think of some way to criticize it, but I can't really. I wish it were a little creamier smooth, but, um, you know, maybe while I was in the Goodwill it cooled down a little bit. But it's really kind of not very cold outside today either, so I'm not sure why it doesn't have more of a creamy filling. Um, but definitely it's not that sort of cold, hard um, filling. It's It's got a little bit of a, a softness to it, but definitely it's not... You know, creamy, delicious, melted chocolate goodness. So that's it for today, I guess. <clears throat> Let me know if you're planning to pick up any fun candies for your uh, Valentine's Day. Let me know what you enjoy. And uh, that's it for today. I will hopefully see you in another Candy in the Car review soon. Maybe in this car, maybe in my new one. Let's see. Till then, take care.